Hello again. Today we're going to be looking at the artwork of um, Giuseppe Archimbaldo. He was a painter in the 1500s and he made portraits of things, um, you know, painted things found in nature like, I don't know if you can see here, vegetables, fruits, and flowers. So today we're going to be doing, instead of a painting, we're going to be doing a collage. And a collage is when you take small bits of material and arrange them into a larger work of art. And so being inspired by Archimboldo, we're going to take some magazine cutout pictures of different fruits and vegetables that I put in an envelope for you in your art supply bag. Um, and we're going to cut some of these little fruits and veggies out, rearrange them into um, like I guess you could say a person's face or maybe an alien or a monster of some sort. Um, I, I can show you the two that my son and I did earlier today. Take some chicken, chicken wings and some cabbage, mashed potatoes, and made this character. Took some of that same cabbage and a fish tail some strawberries and some chili peppers and made that guy. Um, so I have already decided um, that I, well, actually I should mention, um, if you have black paper still left, um, I like working in smaller, with smaller pieces. So I cut my pages down. This is not a full size page, Can you see that? It's, um, I just, this one is actually only half of a page because I like working a little bit smaller, it's less intimidating. So you will need black paper and scissors and your cut out fruits and vegetables. Um, I, I usually like to find one piece that's sort of, like in this case, I chose this mashed potato as my face, like as a starting point. And this one, I, this fishtail, it just looked to me like a hairdo. So that's where I'm gonna start off. And I'm gonna choose other pieces for eyes, nose, and mouth. Um, I think I've already decided that I like this little strawberry. So the strawberry, I think I was going to try and turn that into a nose. And you know you can cut down these, these fruit shapes and vegetable shapes even smaller if you need them to be smaller. So hopefully you still have a glue stick. That's all I've been using. Works really well. Um, and this is where your imagination has to really take over. What do you want your what do you want your character to be like? Scary, um, friendly, happy, um, menacing. I think this guy is gonna be just pretty cool. I found these little cardamom pods that look like eyeballs, so that's gonna be my eyes. And you can do a face, whole body, whatever floats your boat. There's eyes, nose. So I think I just want to find a mouth. And I already have this little lime cut out. It's going to look like he's got his mouth open. There. And now I could go on and, you know, put arms on him. Um, Maybe he doesn't really have a place for legs, but, um, or you know, you could put a hat. You can do anything you want and make an interesting, fun, sort of food person thing. Um, have fun and we'll talk to you again soon.